Welcome back, Travis of the Sada Havoc here, and we are back playing a little more Forever Stranded Lost Souls. And as you can see, I got some stuff done in the meantime. So, uh, with these tanks, I decided, you know what, the design was farmland, let's see if it works, and planted a little bit. I've got some wheat growing right now because, well, right now the cheapest thing I can do is make uh, bread. And <clears throat> interestingly enough, bread gives you like, let's see. Uh, bread gives you uh, one and a half meat sickles, and then it gives you seven saturation. But you, one of these divides into ten, and each one of these gives you half and half. So basically, I'm getting five and five, right? So saturation, not as good, but I'm getting more meat sickles. So I'm kind of just trying to work on the bread since I've got the wheat growing and kind of working on that. But I'm thinking there might be other ways to make food, right? So every time I, well, not every time, but every now and then when I chop down a tree, I've been getting these bugs. Not a lot. I've got like five. I think I got them all out of my chest um, and kind of sorted out over there. But I've got some of the bugs. And so I'm thinking maybe we can deep fry the bugs in the fryer and get that done. So the first thing I want to do today is uh, make the fryer. But before we do that, I want to kind of show you what's been going on around here. Um, I did start recording and then had a little issue in the middle and kind of stopped recording. And so I've gotten some stuff done that was uh, intended to be on camera. Oh, what are you? You're like all purple burning and stuff. Um, and now my sword's dead. Okay. But I don't remember if I had these before, but these little uh, interdiction torches, they're pretty cool. They keep uh, mobs away. So I can just stand here safely and they can't get to me. And then I've got the other one right over there by my work area. And so they've been keeping me safe. Um, as you can see, I've got some stone laid down or cobblestone laid down just to start kind of cleaning this area up and making it a little bit more pretty, as well as the Endermen don't pick up this. They pick up the netherrack, but they won't pick up the cobble. So that's a good thing. But let us go make ourselves a sword real quick. Um, I've got, I think the quartz is over here. I've upgraded from doing um, the flint to quartz. I don't know if it's really all that much better, but it's easier because all I have to do is go pound um, nether quartz with a hammer and I can get quartz relatively easily. Just a little bit cheaper than getting the uh, flint. So I think this is, oh, okay. Apparently I can't even use this sword. How can I can use the pick? I've already made a nether quartz pick, but I can't use the nether port quartz sword. What do I need? Uh, 10 defense. Is that a defense and attack? Um, okay, so that's not an option. <laughs> Let's go put that over here with the other stuff that I can't use. Okay, so I guess stone sword it is. Cool. No biggie. I still got my stone sword. I had an iron sword up until a second ago, and then it just broke, so. Uh, let's kill these guys real quick, and then I'll finish giving you the, the lay of the land and the tour of what's been done done so far not too much but I have gotten a little bit done oh oh another one of those hearts nice what's this uh, spore yeah we know all that stuff uh, what are you you have prot 3 or projectile prot 3 I'll stick with the projectile because the blazes are the ones that seem to hit me from a distance so I can't break the quartz yet so this is going to stick here but I, I want to start getting the stuff out of the ship and into like a work area and start kind of working out from here. So we'll see how that goes. Uh, that's just a work in progress. That's not something we're going to be really doing today. But I've started more dirt collection. And as a matter of fact, I might go grab a couple more leaves. I think I have more leaves upstairs. I've been trying to get as much dirt as possible because we do want to get some porcelain done, which is uh, the dirt inside the... Well, my brain's not processing. What was I looking for up here? Oh yeah, leaves. That's what I was coming up here for. There's some right there. And there's more of them right there. Okay. Uh, the dirt in the sawmill or whatever that thing's called, millstone, yeah, gives us the clay. And so we need as much dirt as possible because that achievement looked like it was gonna take a lot of bit of clay. And then I also, because I've been dealing with hunger issues so much, that's why I've been working. Oh, hey, hey. What did you just do? He just got struck down. Yeah, boy. Don't mess with me. That's what happens when you hit me. I don't know what happened, but I'm happy that he died. So, um, yeah, so I want to try to get some power going with this guy here. I'll just break this one, whatever. 
Maybe we get no stick. Okay, so I want to get some power going so I don't have to keep doing this because hunger is an issue that I've been battling with. So yeah, I did also. Um, this was the part that I was recording last time. Um, there was I was trying to make a book to uh, get going on the engineer. So so let me get you caught up here. Yeah. So I was looking into Tinkers, right? Or not Tinkers, uh, immersive engineering, and as you can see, I've already made my hammer. But I need to make the engineer's manual. To do that, I need to make a book. And I don't have the leather right now. So basically what I did was uh, basically make the tinker's book, right? Using this and a string. But it's not a string, it's a filament. So to get this filament, you need a string with glowstone, a redstone, and a cauldron. And so basically that's what that guy is up there. Takes a minute. It just basically, you just click on the GUI and put them in here. It cooks them up slowly and then you get what you need. And the filament is somewhere... I don't know what keeps causing mobs to just die. I don't know what's happening there, but I'm not upset about it. Anyway, so I've got the filament and I'm ready to make the book. And so that's, yeah, this is just where we're going. But first things first, we're going to make this fryer. So first thing I need is vegetable oil, which is made with, oh, I can do it with seeds. Oh, okay. I didn't know that. I think I have my seeds in here. One, two, three, four, like so vegetable oil. Is this a shape crafting one? I hate when they're like shape crafting and they have to be in like a specific spot. Yeah, there we go. So there's vegetable oil, cool. And then the uses for vegetable oil are the fryer. And that's pretty easy. That's uh, six pieces of stone and two stone slabs. So let's go grab some cobble, which I think I put over here. There we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, and then one, two, three for the slabs. All right, and I did make a new furnace. Um, I made the cobblestone furnace, but cobblestone was smelting cobblestone at like an insanely slow rate. I think I was going through like three pieces of charcoal, like full charcoal, not the uncompressed tiny pieces, actual charcoal. It was taking like three pieces just to smelt one piece of cobblestone. Absolutely ridiculous. So I looked at the recipe for this and the iron furnace was really super simple. It was just uh, a regular furnace, which I had already made, uh, wrapped in... Um, these iron plates and so I used my engineer's hammer which I'm gonna need so I should probably grab that I just don't remember where anything is organization is crazy oh you gotta be in one of these uh, there it is okay yeah so this with iron makes the iron plates and then made that real real simple easy peasy there and then yeah, that's, that's about all I really got done in the meantime. Now, as you can see, I've got some paper hanging here. Um, I do have two pieces of sugar cane in there. What I want to do, actually, let me start those up. I'm turning these into paper and I'm waiting for one more. So what I can do is actually make a paper tree and then hopefully make the bonsai today. And so then I can just kind of generate paper for books and stuff like that later. So we'll, we'll see how that goes. Um, let's craft this into wheat flour and then I can throw you in there <coughs> And I like this if you throw a second item in here just pushes over and lets the next one cook. That's really really cool All right, so 10 of you and there we go and let me eat one real quick just to Get you out of the way Yeah, so it's not the the bestest but it's not bad. It's not horrible. So um, one, two, three stone slabs, one and two there, uh, right there and the vegetable oil in the middle. And now we've got a fryer. So we're going to go put this right over here. I don't know if I'm going to need like a fuel for, I do need fuel. Okay, cool. Fortunately, all my coal's in right here. Now let us see if tiny coal works in this. It does. And then we can fry them up. Okay, cool. That's pretty cool. So now we'll have some edible bugs and it seems to be pretty quick. That's not too bad. That is worth three full nuggets and 12 such. Oh my goodness. Oh, I'm, I'm so happy right now. Okay. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, seven. Let's go ahead and fill this up. That is a pretty darn good food source to start with. This is three meat sickles plus 12. This is three plus 12. And I'm figuring this is probably about the same. Yeah, that's, that's some pretty good nutrition. I don't need the bread anymore. That's awesome. So, Fryer, loving you. 
you are awesome and that was also an achievement finished back under survival so let's go claim that Ooh, see this is giving me four of each that's a lot but loot chests you never know what you're gonna get it might be worth it and then sometimes you get redstone lamps which one of these chests already has they're there all right cool so there and there cool redstone lamps whatever um so moving on We've got that one complete. This is my target for the day, but I want to be able to do this thing manually, right? So we've got the engineer's hammer. I just need to make the engineer's manual, which means I need a book. How far? You're almost there. Okay, so we'll swap these guys out and get rid of some of the stuff. I don't need you. This is all just junk. Oh, coal I want to hold on to. We'll put the seeds back where they were, like so and put the coal back in here cool then i'm kind of collecting not that i'm smelting but i just kind of feel like those materials over by the furnace just make sense so i've got those sitting over there all right cool now take you dry one more out and there we go that's the one i've been waiting for because what i can do now is do the bonsai tree while we're waiting on that one to dry out uh so the bonsai bonsai is made with eight or sorry five brick and a dirt we've got and then the bricks um under smelting right yeah we can just smelt up some clay so i need five dirt in the millstone so we can go do that and now i've got those buggies so that should give me a decent amount of saturation which will be awesome oh and look at that i already had dirt in here okay cool so we've got quite a bit going on here so let's get these clays done and then once we get the clays done We'll be able to make the bonsai so we can reproduce paper and wood and leaves and saplings and all that stuff uh, on the regular. And look how fast the hunger goes down doing this. It's like half a meat sickle. It's one whole meat sickle per. Yeah, I don't even have the energy. All right, let's. There we go. There we go. And we'll keep this going. Pick up more clay. There's two. I need three more. And then we'll be good to go there. And then we can get the bonsai going. And I should have enough iron to actually make the um, the hopper bonsai. And I believe you can just put that above a chest and it just automatically does it. And that would be great. That would be great if that was the case. I'm not 100% sure how the bonsais work. I only got introduced to them um, relatively recently when I was kind of doing my research for uh, the other series. Um, oh, hey for uh, modern skyblock and so i was just kind of learning about them there good grief like i can't tell where they're at those guys are such a pain oh and i've got 18 levels let's see what we should spend those on real quick um i think we should start boosting up attack and defense a little bit i've got eight levels left i can use one in each okay so we'll do that I don't know. I want to get my mining skills up pretty soon, but it's not a complete necessity at the moment. So we'll get the bricks going there. Um, I need to go grab a piece of dirt again. And I might as well just empty out these over here. So we'll get those all taken out. What keeps causing lightning to strike right there? I see a sparkly guy. I wonder if that's the guy that's doing it. I don't know. That's kind of weird. I mean, it killed the one guy, which was cool, but that was like over, I don't know. Ah, these guys are so annoying. Okay, well, you're dead now, so cool. Um, get the clay, got the dirt. We should be able to make this guy up pretty quickly. Like a soul. Bonsai done. Hammer, why did you go in there? I don't know. And then I've got an extra chest or two around here somewhere. <coughs> right there and then I know I've got like I think I said 10 iron just a second ago which will give me the five I need for the hopper so one two three four and there hopper and bonsai cool and then now I need to make another chest for this stuff to go into um, <coughs> one two three and woods around here somewhere I hate the being like this unorganized like it just it kills me to have stuff like all over the place right now i need some kind of organization maybe drawers but i don't know if i can set drawers down yet 
So we'll see. All right, so there's an inventory. <coughs> Let us just put this guy right here for right now. So chest there and uh, bonsai right there. Cool. And then I need to make, I need a sapling. That's what I need. I've got him around here somewhere. See, I just total disorganization. Oh wait, it's over in this chest. There's one. So if I put you with paper, do you make the paper tree? No. How do I make the paper tree? I know I saw it. Um, paper, sapling, paper tree, sapling, right there. <coughs> oh, it's three pieces of paper. Ooh. I mean, I might as well make it now. I just might as well. And we'll get you going. So let's make you up real quick. And let's see if this thing works correctly. So if I stick you on there, you're going to start growing extremely slowly. And then once you're fully grown, you should just drop the stuff in the chest, right? I'm, I'm assuming. It just kind of makes sense. It's the hopping bonsai instead of the regular one. So instead of just getting one at a time, it's automatically going to chop the tree down. I think this is such a cool animation. The fact that you just get to watch the tree grow, unlike, you know, when real trees just kind of pop up out of nowhere, this kind of kind of... What was making that noise? I don't know. Um, so, yep. Yeah, so just, just, but I didn't get anything. Maybe it's a kind of chance drop thing. I don't know. That's kind of interesting. I would have thought I would have got something from that. Let's wait one more time because it doesn't take too long. And let's go claim the quest reward while we're doing this. Uh, it's not survive. Uh, I think it was stuffing things. Yep. There we go. So we got those. Claim that chest. Let's open up, I open up our loot bag here. An enchanted book, efficiency five, and an amb. Okay, that's useful. That might be the first legitimately useful thing I've gotten so far. I'm just gonna put you in here for right now. Did I get anything that time? Oh, we got a piece of paper. Awesome. So that is exactly what we wanted. Now I just need, what, uh, two more pieces of paper. That one's gonna be paper in a second. And then hopefully this will produce another piece of paper pretty soon. And then we'll be able to make our book, which means we'll be able to open up more of immersive engineering and finally get some power so I can power that stinking millstone and not use all of my... Got it. Oh, how lucky is that? Okay, so 60%. Okay, so let's plan of attack here. So immersive tech. I want to get to this. I need to make the book. The book is... I think it's the hammer and... Oh, no, I think it's a lever. That's what it is. Um... If I can spell, there it is. A lever and a regular book, okay. Um, I have a couple spares. Uh, filament, I gotta go find that filament. It's around here somewhere. The dis ah, There it is, perfect. You're at 83%, how about you over here? Oh, got you, perfect. Got what we need, and now I just need a piece of cobble. Do I have any on me? No. Let me grab a piece of cobble from over here and a stick from this chest. <coughs> there we go. So, lever. What is that? Rock. Okay, I can make rocks. Good to know. Uh, U2, filament, paper, book, book, lever, engineer's manual. Awesome. Let's go. Oh, look at that. This is actually putting out a decent amount of paper and another sapling. <coughs> I think this is a good, good thing. Good, good thing right there. Okay. Now, what did that open up? Claim. Okay. This is now we're talking. Razor, I don't need that. Steel, I don't need that. But kinetic energy, that I do need. So we got to do the Coke oven. So we got to make some Coke brick. Let's see. Well, let's open up our loot chest first. Magenta runic dust. Can't use it anyways. Who cares? All right, cool. You go away. I don't need you. Don't need you. Don't need you. I'm going to hold on to you guys just in case. And let's look up the recipe for Coke brick and start heading in the right direction. A uh, block of coal Coke. Coke brick. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. I need nine recipes of this, which means I'm going to need 72 clay. Really? And then sandstone. 
and there's no other way. 72 clay manually. Is there any other power source that's open that I can do? Oh, that's just so much. Uh, what is this? Mechanical things? Um, and then automatic cobblestone? What is mechanical things? Mechanical miner, mechanical user. Uh, getting a court early game can be hard as you need to defeat some bosses to get them to try the simpler miner. Uh, users will do this job. For, okay. Not, not quite what we're thinking. A soul shard. Stone builder. I thought I already made one of those. Well, let's get those quests done really quick since I can. Um, it was an iron and a cobble. The iron. I already made the iron one too, so I may not have to make it again. I don't know if these work like with the gates where you're, um, if you don't have the one unlocked before, then you have to. Let's see. So you, I thought I already made this guy. Okay, there we go. Stone builder's one. Do I get the iron one already? Because I've already made it. No. No, I don't. So let's make an iron builder's wand. It's all right. I will use it. I actually just broke mine when I was building that room over there. So cool. Let's claim these loot chests. Um, wrong one again. How do you keep going back? Claim you. Ooh, factory blocks. Not too bad. I actually wouldn't mind that to replace the one that I broke and lost earlier. I don't even know what happened to it. It's just gone. It's gone, though. All right, good loot chests. Ooh, finally got a good one, and then I get it twice in a row. Of course I did. And watch this be the same. No. Ooh, full iron set, though. Is that better than what I'm currently wearing? Uh, Chainmail, not very good. Uh, can I even wear it? I can wear it. See, that's got the protection three on it, though. And they're not that much better. It's six and five. Yeah, I think I'm going to keep my unbreaking two in my prop for right now. So let's find a chest that has room um, and put these three in there for right now. All right, cool. Cool, cool, cool. So other stuff I wanted to check out while we're waiting uh, because that clay is... Because oh, I need a lot of clay for this. But this one, the obelisk, I can make right now. The obelisk takes two iron, a red die, and three stone slabs. It just so happens I have three more stone slabs sitting around here somewhere. There we go. One, two, three. And then a red die I can do with a red petal like that. And then I just got to make the bowl and pistol, which if I remember correctly is a bowl, a plank, and a stick. So let me grab that. I'm hoping that recipe is still the same. Um, I don't have any planks. Let me just grab one of you. And I've got bowls in here, right? There they are. Okay, we'll do that. All right, so you go like that. And it's bowl, plank, stick bowl, plank. Yeah, uh, they might actually have to be done shape crafting. Uh, plank, bowl, stick. What is it? Uh, right here. What's the recipe? Oh, geez. One off. Okay, cool. And then you with you. How do I do the dust? This right here. No, that's not the one. Let's just look at Batania. This one right here, floor red powder. Really, it's just, it's gotta be placed in that very specific spot, good grief. All right, two more pieces of iron, one, two, and now I can make the obelisk, which I'm really not even sure what it is, but sometimes I just see the achievement, or like, all right, cool, let's do it. Hold shift, okay, I've got that. So what is this? What actually is this? Uh, want to change your spawn point? This block will act as a bed for the nether without the boom. Oh, that's kind of cool. So if I wanted to change my spawn point for whatever reason, I can just go put it like we'll say. I don't want to like put it in the middle of the room. Um, I don't know if it's going to stay here, so <laughs> I don't know. Uh, we'll just put it here for right now. I'm figuring I can probably pick it back up. Uh, was already defined as a spawn point. Okay, cool. So apparently this is my spawn point now. 
I don't know if that's really all that useful, but hey, it was an achievement, and I'm sure I'm about to get a loot chest for it, so I'm all about it. Oh, choice rewards. Iron hoe, compact giant, and a block of iron, or two loot chests. Nope, not passing up on the opportunity for two loot chests. Four chests, not horrible. They are, and ladder to paranoia, which I don't need right now, because I don't really need to put torches down. I don't even carry torches on me. And you can go in here. I'm really just like stuffing stuff in drawers now. Like I really, if I like, if I see wood, I should grab it so I can put it back with other stuff. Lantern paranoia. Um, what else can go in here? We'll put the chest in here. And wood was over here, so then I can put that there. Cool. All right, cool. So we are headed in the right direction. Here we go. So this one is pretty much. This is the portal to get to the overworld. That we, nowhere near that. We'll just ignore that for right now. Um, this is what I want to get, but clay is kind of hard. We can knock out a few of these quests. This isn't too easy or too hard. Um, I already made the heavy. Okay, yeah, I did make it. Oh, I gotta make something else. Compressed gravel, compressed sand, and compressed dust. Okay, um, where is my compressed hammer? Okay, I don't want to use this one just because it's a quest and I don't I haven't gotten credit for it yet so I want to keep that on me let's go make a stone hammer um, how many to make the compressed hammer uh, let's see compressed hammer it takes nine hammers okay so nine and then sticks and we got tons and tons of that so easy peasy uh, over here <clears throat> except I need more Yeah, I'm going to need four more. Uh, okay, so more cobble somewhere around here. If not, I can go mine some up real quick. Got an iron hammer there. Cobble. See, I got all this cobble. I can just make another chisel real quick to fix that problem. Or just grab one of these, like so, and give myself cobble this way. Boop. Boop. There we go. Press cobble. And one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. <clears throat> okay, cool. And then we'll just shift click you in like that and boom, compressed hammer. <clears throat> now, oh, that was the achievement I hadn't even done yet. Okay. Uh, let's make nine compressed blocks again real quick. Um, that just so didn't sort out the way I was trying to get it to. Eight, and let me grab one more over here. Uh, where were you? You're in this chest. There we go. Break that down. Perfect. Um, let's put eight of these back. Uh, I don't have any room. What don't I need? I don't need this pressure plate. This pressure plate is silly. It just tried to kill me. That's all it did. Okay. So we are going to go ahead and put down the nine compressed which should give me the gravel, right? Perfect. Then I can make the nine compressed gravel. Oh, this is just not gonna work. Okay. There we go, nine compressed gravel. So that should update, cool. And then nine compressed sand next and then nine compressed dust and we'll be good there we go um i wish i just had oh there we go compressed sand there we go that's much faster and then compressed dust and we will be good to go with this comp i see i i like kind of just knocking out the quest really quick um because you know i want to get into the good stuff and we're gonna have to like kind of get all these things unlocked first. So let's see. Um, ooh, that's that's nine. Yeah, no, that's the time I am gonna stick because I don't have any diamond. So we are taking the the mesh. Definitely, definitely taking the mesh. Okay, let me put those in here for right now. There we go. Because I don't have any diamond, so that's kind of far off for that one. So um, and then the dust. I guess we can just put you over here too. Like so, and I just noticed my screen is getting faded, which means I need to eat. The bugs are pretty good. Pretty darn good. 
All right, cool. Now, what else can we get done? <clears throat> the iron hammer. And then I haven't made the diamond, but I got this as a reward. So that's why I got this one. The diamond hammer. I don't have any diamonds. I'm going to have to figure out how to get diamonds. But I can... Well, I've already got the iron. I don't have the 20 iron. Yeah, that's all I have in iron right there. How are you doing over here? Looking okay. Got a couple pieces. Good, doing okay. Got some leaves in there. Cool, cool, cool. I don't know why I'm still carrying these around. I don't need them. I don't need the hammers or the builder's wands right now. Sticks I'm okay without. And engineers, yeah, you all can go back in there. Cool. Okay, so pretty much at a standstill in this area. Oh, you know what? Stone barrel. I probably can make those. I don't know why I would really need a stone barrel. Maybe generating cobblestone. Um, rough brownstone. Is that the only way? How do I make this stuff? That's with sandstone and redstone. will give me three of those. And I need three, six. So I need three recipes. So I need nine sandstone and six redstone. Do I have enough redstone? I've mined up a little bit uh, after I got my mining level up. I might have some. I've only got three there. And I didn't see any over there. So I'm going to have to go find some more redstone. So we'll come back to that one. What about the crucible? Can I make the crucible? Um, unfired crucible is going to be with porcelain clay. That's more clay. Everything is coming back to clay. Everything is coming back to clay. And I'm just, I'm really trying to hold off on it because, oh my goodness, it's a lot of work to get to it. And see, I know <clears throat> that this is the mechanical energy we can start doing, but I don't have anything to like power them yet so yeah um let's see that's a lot of clay i need diamond builder one i can't do so short i can't do um wooden spikes not really necessary right now i'm thinking what i need to do is just go ahead and in between this episode and next episode just get all that clay done just just tough it out, um, make myself a whole bunch of bread, and get all that stuff done. Maybe start building up on materials, because I know I can get iron now, right? I can get the iron um, fragments with all those uh, diamond stiffened meshes. There, where are you at? Where are the little seed thingies? Crushed, is it called crushed iron? No. Um, let's go to the sieve. So the heavy sieve, heavy jungle sieve, whatever, it doesn't really matter. Um, uses, right? Under sieving. Um, hold on. I know you can like kind of bring these up for uses, right? Yeah, there we go. So under sieving, um, heavy sieve with diamond meshes. There we go. So... Here's the one right here. So compressed gravel, or I can do this regular sieve too, but I can start getting iron with like a 20% chance. So I might do that in between this episode and next, as well as just grind out the clay. As much as I don't want to, I'm gonna have to. It's gonna take a lot of bread and a lot of you know the rest, but at least I can start getting going on that and getting some iron built up so that I, other things that I'm gonna need iron for right now, I'll be able to do. Um, but, oh, I'm not, look, I, I can't lie. I am not looking forward to going through all the clay to get this. Because I thought if I got into the immersive tech, it was going to open up some power options. But the Coke oven is the first thing. And that's a lot of brick. That was 72 clay I need. Which means I'm going to have to go make a lot more dirt and a lot more clay and get that going. But I think it's the better step instead of trying to get other things first. If I can get this powered, um, it'll be so much better. So... I guess there's the first 31 and more to come. So I hope you guys are enjoying today's episode. And like I said, it, today was just kind of like, you know, really trying to grind through so we can start getting more fun stuff done. That's really what it comes down to. Not a lot of this stuff is entertaining, but I do want to start getting like power and, you know, immersive tech is definitely a good way to go because I don't think I can make most of the generators yet. Um, I don't know, like a furnace generator. Uh, can I even play? Oh, there's no limitation. A machine block? Ooh, so redstone in my future. I might look into that for some power uh, first. 
We'll see. Um, I'll maybe I'll do some testing off camera or in my uh, my test world and kind of see if that's going to help and kind of make plans for the next episode. But I did get a lot of what I wanted to get accomplished. Um, you know, nothing really changed build wise, but we did get our bonsai tree, which is awesome. We opened up uh, immersive engineering, which is awesome. And yeah, I found a new way to make food. So oh, I did that before, but uh, yeah, no, I'm happy frying bugs. Who would have thunk that frying bugs is so useful. So I guess it's back to the grind of shearing and, you know, chopping trees down and doing all that fun stuff. And when we come back, we'll just basically have a whole bunch of dirt and clay and we'll be able to continue on from there. So y'all know the deal until next time travelers, I am Slider Havoc and I am out of here. Peace.